my name's Sam Marvin, and I'm you're here at my restaurant Echo and Rig in Las Vegas. So this is a tri-tip right here, right? Obviously, you see why it's called a tri-tip, right? Because of the three different tips on the steak. The tri-tip comes from the uh, bottom bottom sirloin of the animal. So it's in the back leg area, back of the saddle, right? In this area is, is the lower, uh, is the, the bottom sirloin. That's where the tri-tip comes from. You know, it's, it's an amazing cut of steak. So this is one portion that we're doing. You can see the marbling in it. This tri-tip comes here right now. This is a American Wagyu cattle. This comes from Snake River Farms in Wyoming. And uh, they're breeding, uh, they're breeding Japanese style cattle, Kobe yeah. beefs. This is probably one of the only steaks I slice for my guests. Because when I'm slicing steaks for people, you give them a whole steak, they slice it themselves, right? They're having a steak. If you slice the tri-tip incorrectly, it's very, very tough. So when we serve a tri-tip upstairs, we slice it for our guests. And you can see the grains of the tri-tip. You see how they're all going this way? So if we were to cut this steak and I took a knife and I just start cutting it this way, it would be a very tough steak, right? If I cut it this way against the grain, it melts in your mouth, right? So another cut we do here is this is called, this is called a bavette. Uh, a bavette in France and in American, bavette from French to English translates to bib. So it looks like a bib. So this is what we call a bib steak here in the United States. It's a very common steak in France, the bavette. And I'll tell you what's so great about the bavette. So the bavette, again, the more marbling you see, the better. Look at this piece of meat. It almost looks like a candy cane. You see all the stripage that's going in there? The more marbling, it melts in your mouth, it's tender. If I was gonna choose one steak on this entire block, including ribeyes and, and everything else you can imagine, and New York's, I would choose a bavette every time.